Hey guys, so this is another first impressions video. This time is for Charmo and <laughs> they released another four star and he looks really really fun for sure. So uh this is something that I've noticed. Uh check out his voice. That's the only thing he says. I don't know if that is an error or a problem. Uh, he should have been saying at least two things. Usually four stars say, say at least uh, two things there. But anyway, uh, he's an interest, interesting hero. Uh, uh, it's not a, exactly a competitive hero, but it's a fun hero. Because I'm going to explain to you in a second. So here are his skills. So deals 288 damage to the target and reduces their accuracy by 10% for three turns. Decreases the caster's damage taken by 64%. That is huge. <laughs> damage uh, there. Damage reduction. And takes 80% damage for nearby allies. Uh, lasts for three turns. So this is going to be pretty fun. I'm going to explain it to a second. The only thing is that's going to be a defense team. This is definitely thought about for defense teams but it's a it's you can actually make an other team around this i'm going to explain that a little bit in a second but let's talk about his awakenings here uh so his plus one increases defense by 15 percent for two turns when taking damage this if i can stack this is nice but it's not too crazy uh usual 10 percent restores three mana when taking damage uh not groundbreaking good to have and the usual 10%. So his his awakenings, they really didn't uh, give him much, really. They they didn't really give him something too crazy on the awakenings. It would have been nice to actually have a little bit more things there. But sadly, that's what we got. However, do remember that uh, he's an Idrith hero. So by being an Idrith hero, a, by Idrith hero, I mean all these heroes here. So that this is gonna be pretty pretty fun to actually play around because first of all he is a strength hero. So in your team you could use him as a, a whip holder, which uh Edry Forest uh doesn't have a have a lot of uh strength heroes actually. Uh, Valencia is a strength hero. Maybe you can put uh Valencia as uh the whip holder and the rest the rest of the heroes just go off, which is pretty nice. So there are strategies out there like in war and in and in um, arena that you can actually try to ma mask out the ability as much as possible, which is here like a two, three, or four. So you're gonna have 25% dodge. So if you have other heroes like uh, Gardor, which is going to make uh, heroes miss a lot, Mina, Percival, Valencia to help the whip, and uh, and Tarmo. So if you have like these these five or maybe Idrita if you have Idrita you can do a, a fun team to actually make the enemy miss as soon as much as possible while Tarmo being at the actual middle so the idea is since his ability is to share with the enemies next to him you have to do uh, the the W uh, I'm sorry the M formation which is uh, pretty much like this so it's gonna be a uh, three heroes in the front and two in the back so Tarmo, Tarmo here is going to be in the middle so when he goes off uh, he's gonna uh, uh, take take all the damage uh, from the from the allies like 80 percent and uh, he's gonna get uh, 60 what was it uh, 64 yeah 64 percent damage taken so that's gonna be pretty fun to actually see so if you have Percy right next to him, <laughs> that's going to be really funny. Because he's going to make people miss a lot, and he has crazy dodge. And uh, maybe Gardo on the other side, he's going to make people miss a lot. So yeah, it, Tarmo, Tarmo is not going to be super competitive like in war and things like that. But you can do a fun uh, Edrith team for Arena maybe. And play around with him. So he, he's going to help the, the entire team survive more. And uh, it, it could be interesting. Could be interesting for sure. So yeah, uh, Tarmo is not groundbreaking. He's not too crazy, but he can make <laughs> he can 
make nice teams for you to play around in arenas. And remember, this is a game, so you can play around with different teams and uh, try to see what what uh, interesting interactions you can do. And if you, and and if you're bold. You can do it in arena. Um, I'm sorry, in war as well, because now in 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 war you may need to have two teams, or even three teams if you're in a high level guild. So maybe your second or third team could have Tarmo in it, and make people <laughs> scratch their he heads by missing and dodging so much, you know. So yeah, guys. Uh, first of all, you you gotta have fun with this game. It is a game after all. All right. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Have a great day. Bye bye.